In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Keyword Atlas software on your computer that's running a Windows operating system. So I'm running Windows 10, but this will work on previous versions of Windows as well. So once you get to the download page that you see here, you'll see that there's two uh, different versions we can download, one for the Windows and then one for your Macintosh. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Windows version. So all we have to do is go ahead and click the green button here, and it'll ask us to download the software. So I'm going to go ahead and download it to my computer. And if you don't know where to download it on a computer, on the left hand side here, usually you can find somewhere like I like putting in the two downloads or you can even put it on your desktop if you'd like. So I'm going to go ahead and just put it in my downloads folder and go and click save. And down on the bottom here, you'll see a little note that you have downloaded the file. I'm using Chrome. I believe with Firefox, same thing would happen. But then you just you can click here and you can actually click show in folder there. So you go click here and then show in folder. And you go right to the downloads folder and in here this is the file that we downloaded which is a zip file so the setup file is contained inside of this compressed zip file in Windows they make it really easy to extract contents of a zip file all you have to do is just right click and select extract all it'll ask you where you want to extract it you can just leave it it'll just make another folder in the same location with the same name as that zip file let's go ahead and click extract and it'll open up a window and show you the setup right inside. So to set up this software, all you have to do here is the first thing you should try is right click and select run as administrator. Usually things will work out a little bit better when you do when you do it that way. Now if you do not see run as administrator, just go ahead and double click that with your left mouse button. But I'm going to right click and select run as administrator first time you run or try to uh, set up the software you're gonna see this little Windows protected uh, kind of warning now you don't have to worry about anything with my software I personally designed the software myself from scratch and um, I make sure I check you know viruses and all that kind of stuff so there's absolutely no way my software can harm your computer whatsoever so you don't have to worry about this all you have to do is just click on the more info and then click on run anyway and that brings up the setup file and in here you click next, agree, and then next, and I'll go ahead and install it in the default location. And you do have the option to open it up right away. So click finish, and it'll open right up. And the first time the software opens up, it'll ask you to enter in your enter in your email address to register it. Let me just quickly show you that. Just bring up the software one more time here, and you'll see. So you'll see this little box here and you have to enter in the email that you used when you purchased the software or acquired the software somehow. Um, put your email in there and then register it on your computer. And after you do that, you get a little message saying it's been registered and you just click OK. And it'll be fully activated and ready to go on your Windows PC software. 